how to flatten a Z stack confocal image using image A or Fiji. So once we open a Z stack image, we see that it's uh, not a single image, but it's uh, a combination of uh, many uh, Z stacks. So it's important to merge all these layers into single layer so we can see the image nicely. To do that, click on image, then click on stacks and then click on Z project. And here it's asking about the uh, start slice and the stop slice because we have a total of 98 slices. If you want to get rid of some of the slices, uh, maybe in the start or maybe at the end, which are not good enough, so you can get rid of that. And in the bottom is asking about the projection type. And here we have the various options, average intensity, maximum, minimum intensity and the options. Uh, but it's uh, good to use the maximum intensity, although you can uh, try other parameters as well. Choose the maximum intensity, then click OK. And here you get your final flattened image, which is a single layer. If you see here, you still see uh, two channels options here. If you want to change the parameters of the, any of these channels, you can still do that. Uh, for example, we are here at the channel 1. And uh, if you want, you can change the adjustments to make it look better something like this so this is the blue channel the depi channel and you can also increase the brightness or the contrast and similarly you can go to the other channel and change this as well we have this red channel so we can increase or decrease the brightness so something like that so once you're happy with the adjustment, uh, so all you have to do is save the image. So click on file, then save as. And you can choose the format you want, but it's easier to use the uh, JPEG format. Uh, then choose the location and then you can save. So here is our image we have just saved. So if you click on it, so you can see this is the image. So you can import it and you can further annotate or uh, do whatever you want.